and welcome back to HVAC Talk, Let's Be Real. My name's Renee, I'm one of the owners of LCS. I'm Ryan, I'm an installer with LCS. Okay, so today we're gonna give you a real solution to heating or cooling rooms in your home that maybe have never had heating or cooling before. And that option is a ductless mini split. So Ryan, tell me a little bit about types of spaces in homes that might benefit from having a ductless mini split. Uh, you'll have different rooms that the ductless mini split would be really great at. Oh, hello mini. <laughs> Go on, Ryan. <laughs> um, a great spot would be in addition to your home, if you're adding on, uh, doing any construction work, that would, that would be a good spot for ductless mini split. Um, a sunroom would be a great spot for a mini split or in-law quarters. A mm. room above a garage, those are typically really good spots for a ductless mini split. That's a great idea. And I tell you what, I have a personal testament also. Travis and I have a sunroom in our home that we could really only use in the fall and the spring. And he added a ductless mini split to that area and now we can use it all year round. It's fantastic and it really makes us feel like we have a whole nother room that, that was given to us in our home. It was, it's great. Yeah. So tell me a little bit about the benefits of a ductless mini split. One of the benefits, um, they're very energy efficient to run. Uh, they'll really cut down on your cost. Okay, um, compared to a traditional system. Yes. Okay, all and right. they're quiet. Ooh. Um, that's one really great thing about mini splits is that they're quiet you really won't even know that they're running sometimes. That is fantastic. So what do they look like? Are they located inside? Are they located outside? Where are they at? Typically, there'll be two, two units, um, an indoor unit that will hang on the wall and an outdoor unit. Okay, and so they're connected by a line set just like a traditional system. Does the outdoor unit look like a regular air conditioner or heat pump? No, they're a little bit smaller. Um, they can sit a little bit more flush with your wall, with your exterior oh. wall. I didn't know that actually. So great, that's, that's good to know. So how long does it take to install a mini split? Are we looking at a couple of hours, a couple of days? You'll be looking at about a full day for an install of a mini split. Okay, so it's definitely labor intensive to get that installed, charged, all of that good stuff. Yes. Okay. Yeah, yeah it's definitely a full day's worth of work. Okay, so mini splits are a great option. When you have that small space in your home, a room, a sunroom, an addition that Ryan was talking about, that doesn't have any ductwork going to it. Ductwork is what the air travels through in a traditional system. And so rather than adding all of that, you can just look at the option of a ductless mini split. Yeah. yeah. So I hope that's giving you some good information about mini splits and if they might be a good option for you and your home. So you know how to reach us if you have any questions at all, we're happy to answer those. In the meantime, we hope you have a fantastic week and we'll see you next week on HVAC Talk, Let's Be Real.